Hey guys, how's it going? It's David here, and uh, I hope everyone's having a blessed day today. Um, I've had a good day at work, doing very good. Um, today I want to do something that I believe God's put in my heart. Um, I want to do devotionals. So, and for 2023, you know, it's been a rough couple years with COVID, and things are finally maybe starting to look up for the. You know, it's been a rough few years, so anyway. Um, but I'm gonna be doing devotionals. Now, this is the this probably ain't gonna be a long video, so but I am gonna post these up on a YouTube channel and a uh Facebook. So if you like, hopefully you'll enjoy these devotions. But I'm gonna try to do these every day. So I, I'm doing a devotional from our a favorite lady we all we should all know, uh, called Joyce Myers, is called Power Thoughts Devotional. 365 daily inspirations for winning the battle of the mind. So it does do by days of the year, but I, like the first one's January 1st, but I'm just going to start with the first page and we'll just go try to do it every, do, try to do each day. So I hope this really blesses everybody. And this, I hope it blesses me too. This is from, just for me, just as much for me as for everybody. So I'm going to open up in prayer and then we'll read this devotional and then we will see what goes. So I'll just give you a heads up, maybe a very short video. So dear Abba Lord, we just thank you for today, Lord. We thank you for uh, 2023, Lord. We just pray. I pray this devotional series that I'm doing will help not only just me, but help everyone to win the battle of the mind, Lord, because that's where the enemy gets us, Lord. I thank you for what you're about to do in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay. So Power of Thoughts devotional number one. It's called Mind, Mouth, Moods, and Attitudes. Behold, I give unto you power to tread on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy, and nothing shall by any means hurt you. Luke ten nineteen King James Version. This is typically how your mind, mouth, moods, and attitudes are connected. When you have a negative circumstance, you have a negative thought. Then you say a negative thing about the circumstance, and then your mood begins to sink. Next, you get a bad attitude, and you end up with more negative circumstances than you started with. But you can break this cycle in your life. Did you know that Luke ten nineteen says, We have power to tread on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy. To tread means to walk all over, to take steps, to take action, to, to resist. You have the power to do these things. When you have a problem, nothing negative will fix it. Keep your mind, mouth, moods, and attitudes positive and watch God works miracles all on your behalf. Power thought in number one in this devotional. In Christ, I have power over negative thinking. So we have in Christ, we have the power to tre tread over scorpions, snakes, and serpent yeah, serpents, same thing, and all over the power of the enemy. And it should not hurt us. So I've definitely been a part, done this. I've failed for this. I'm not perfect at, at this, but I pray that I will be better at this. And I hope this helps you too. But we have to be very careful uh, being negative. You know, it's easy to be negative. It takes, and even when you're around a negative person, it takes one person. It can, it can just take one negative person to make your good day into a bad day or your good mood turn into a bad mood. I know from experience, but... We, let's just remember Luke ten nineteen. Uh, just mark down your verse if you want to journal or some like that. But but that's all I got. Like I said, these videos are probably gonna be short. So but and I'll try to think of some other stuff to do. So but I hope this blesses y'all. Um, pray for me. I'm gonna start making cauliflower buffalo bites for the first time. I pray that I hope it goes well. So trying to learn how to eat healthier. So even I know it's buffalo sauce, but it's cauliflower too. So got it from a uh, healthy YouTube channel. So anyway, I'm going to pray us out of here and that'll be in. Stay tuned for tomorrow. Heavenly Father, I just thank you for this devotional, Lord. I pray for, as you say, Luke 10, 19, we, are, we had the power to tread over serpents and scorpions, Lord, and all the power of the enemy. I pray this word reaches not only just me, but everyone who is watching this devotional, everyone this reaches to. And I pray that 
that this inspires us to become a good mood to have power thoughts. I thank you for what you do, Lord. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Okay, if you like this video on Facebook or YouTube, like it, comment it, share it, whatever you want to do. Uh, I hope this blessed y'all. God bless you. Have a blessed day.